your breath smells. <laughs> <laughs> Our focus is really to present clients with all options because cancer medicine is all options. The next step is actually immunotherapy which is quite advanced. And we've been studying a melanoma vaccine since 2006. And now we actually have got, uh, begun a vaccine for osteosarcoma, uh, which we've been using since 2015. A lot of the cancers that dogs get, uh, for instance lymphoma, um, osteosarcoma which is bone cancer, melanoma are very similar to human cancers. Translational medicine is a very big part of our field, especially oncology, because like Dr. Milner said, we do have a lot of naturally occurring cancers in our patients that do obviously affect our people as well. And so we want to be able to not only aid the, the pets that we love, but also make a bigger difference in the human medicine world as well. I'm actually affiliated faculty in uh, the medical school in pediatric oncology um, because that's the service that deals with osteosarcoma and sarcomas in children. It's a great way of accumulating information uh, about pets with cancers that can be beneficial um, to humans with this disease. Are you your pet people? Oh yeah. Are we, can you tell? <laughs> this is my daughter.